Hello student, welcome to my YouTube channel Bharat Chem Study. Today, in this video, we are going to study about chapter 1 that is periodic property and variation of properties for 10th standard of ICC board. And in this video, that is part 3, we are going to study topics of atomic size, definition, factor affecting atomic radius, its variation along groups and periods with reasons. But before we start with the topic, we must Remember the elements of some important groups and periods. So, I am giving some funny shortcut to learn the groups and periods. For group 1 that is alkali metal, the shortcut is Halina ne ki rab se faria. Where Ha indicate hydrogen, He indicate helium, Lina indicate lithium, Ne indicate sodium, Ki indicate potassium, Rab indicate rubidium, Se indicate cesium and Friyad indicate Frenchium. So this is the method. By learning this line, we will able to arrange the element of group 1 that is alkali metal in exact order. Similarly for group 2, alkaline earth metals. Beta mange car centro ba prazi. Here beta indicate beryllium, mange indicate magnesium, ka for calcium, centro for scrontium, ba for barium and razi for radium. So by knowing this, beta mange car centro ba prazi, the funny shortcut will Help us to arrange the element of group 2 that is Be, Magnesium, Calcium, Scrontium, Barium, Radium in a correct order. And the last element of both these groups, Frenchium and Radium are radioactive in nature. Similarly for group 17 that is Halogen. Faltu class may boring instructor aata hai. Faltu indicate for fluorine. Class indicate for chlorine. Boring indicate or burning indicate bromine. Instructor indicate for iodine and Aata indicate for astatide. This will help us to arrange the element in the correct order of their respective groups. Similarly for periods. Period 1. Hum he. Hum represent hydrogen. He represent helium. For period 2. Loin ko wave ko bana lenge. Koi nahi raha or friend niche. Where loin is used for lithium symbol. Hence wave for beryllium. Bana for boron. Koi for carbon. Nahi for nitrogen. Or for oxygen. Friend for fluorine. And niche for neon. Further period 3. Na mange alu si puri sare kal aenge. Na for sodium, mange for magnesium, alu for aluminium, C, here we are using Si for C for silicon, puri for phosphorus, sare for sulfur, kal for chlorine and aenge for argon. So these are the funniest shortcuts. So the periods are learned, learned as hum hi loin ko wave ko bana lenge, koi nahi raha or front niche, na mange alu si puri, sare kal aenge. By learning this time, we have to, we will learn how to arrange the elements of period in a correct order and that will be helpful. And we are going to study only up to period 3 because in our syllabus, our questions are coming from the elements of up to period 3. That's why we are learning only period up to period 3. Now the periodic properties. The properties which changes or moving along period or are moving from along the group. Either moving along period or group when the, when the properties are going to change, these properties are called periodic properties. For example, atomic size. Metallic and non-metallic character, ionization energy, electron affinity, electron activity, etc. Now let's study the atomic size. The atomic size also called as atomic radius. So definition is of it is it is a distance from the center of the nucleus to the outermost shell containing the electron. That, that means we have to count only that shell which is having the electron. If the shell is not having the electron, that we will not count it in the atom. In this example, we are showing so many shell, but we have count the atomic radius up to only that shell which is having the electron. So here see that only first shell is having the electrons. The atomic radius is for this atom is from the center of the nucleus to the first shell which is containing the electron. But if the electrons are present in the second shell, the atomic radius is from center of the nucleus to the second shell which is having the electron. Because third shell is empty, it is not having the electron. So that will, it is not, we are not going to count it in the terms of atomic radius. But if the third shell is the last shell is having the electron, then the atomic radius is from the center of the nucleus to the outermost shell which is having the electron. Now, we are going to study about the factor which are going to affect the atomic radius. First, factor which is affecting is the number of shells. So with the increase in number of shells, the distance of outermost electron from the nucleus increases therefore the atomic size also increases. Second factor is the nuclear charge. With the increase in nuclear charge the force of attraction on the outermost electron increase so they will be attracted towards the nucleus hence the atomic size decreases. We already have studied in our previous class that in 9th standard that the num how the number of shell is going to be increases on moving down the group and how the nuclear charge is going to be increases on moving along the period. The variation of atomic radii along the group. So we know that 
atomic radius of element increases from top to bottom in a group for example let's see that lithium is having atomic radius 152 while cesium is having atomic radius 262 so that on way down the group the atomic radius is going to be increased here also from fluorine to time the atomic size again going to be increases the atomic radius a of fluorine is 77 but for a stand is 140 pm picometer but why the atomic radius is going to be increases on moving down the group so on moving down the group atomic size increases in the cause of increase in the number of shells so the distance of the electron from the nucleus increases thus the atomic size increases. so when we move from lithium to cesium the number of shell is going to be increases therefore the atomic size is also going to be increases now for period on moving left to right the atomic size decreases or moving left to right along a period for example from lithium to fluorine that is period number two the atomic size of lithium is 152 and for fluorine is 72 on moving along the period the atomic size is going to be decreases so why the atomic size is going to be decrease the reason behind that that on moving left to right along the period the nuclear charge increases so the force of attraction on the outermost electron increases so they are attracted more towards the nucleus hence the atomic radii decreases so the question which is coming from this topic is that uh, the examiner will give us the period or group or the element and we have to arrange them as asked in the question for example here in the question the group 1 is given and we have to increase the element of group 1 in the increasing order of atomic size so let's study how to do this one so we, we know that the element of group 1 element have the correct order as here we are not taking the hydrogen as the group 1 element so lithium sodium potassium rubidium cesium Lina Niki Rapse Faryan. So correct order of group 1 element is this. And we know that on moving down the group atomic size increases. So therefore we can understand from lithium to cesium the atomic size is increasing. So now we are going to arrange the answer. We are going to write the answer. It can be written in two ways. First way that we have to arrange them in the increasing order. And then we put the arrow below it. And then we write in which side that is from left to right the atomic size is equal. the second method that we will write the element and then we use the symbol greater than or less than for explaining where the atomic size is increasing or decreasing so in this case we are using the sign of greater than from left to right because from left to right the atomic size is equal. but in my suggestion avoid this method of writing greater than and less than sign because sometimes the students write the correct order but they put the wrong sign instead of increasing they put the decreasing order so this is the best method because in this method we will put the arrow and below arrow we are writing the from where to where the atomic size is going to be increased in this from left to right the atomic size is increasing that's why our arrow is going from left to so that was the much better method same type of question another period 3 element and we have to increase them in the increasing order of atomic size. So before doing that we must what are the elements of period 3 and what is their exact order. So the exact order of element 3, period 3 elements is sodium, magnesium, aluminium, silicon, phosphorus, sulfur and chlorine. Na mange alu si puri sare kal. We are not taking here the argon because that is a noble gas. So this is the correct method of the elements and we know that from left to right in a period the atomic size is going to be decrease that is from sodium to chlorine atomic size is decreasing but we have to arrange them in the increasing order that means the element which is having the smallest size should be written first and the element with largest size should be written in the last so that's why the correct order will be written as cl s p silicon aluminium magnesium and sodium so we put the arrow to indicate that from here from chlorine to sodium the atomic size is going to be increases or you can write use the sign of greater than so chlorine, sulfur to sodium. We are using the sign of greater than from left to right which show that the atomic size is going to be increased from chlorine to sodium. So this is the way how to you have to write the answers. So do some, let's do some more examples. In the following, here they have the cost. examiner has given us the elements. Now first of all we have to identify which group or which period these elements belong. So because it can contain chlorine, fluorine, bromine iodine so that means this, these are the members of group 17 that is halogen after that we have to arrange them in the decreasing order of the atomic size but before start we should write the correct order the correct order of group 17 elements are this and we know that on moving down the group atomic size increases but in this question we have to arrange the element in the decreasing order but that means we have to move from bottom to top so the correct order will be written as this and then we put the arrow to show that from where the atomic size decreases from left to right or we can use the symbols also here we are using the symbol of less than because here is the ester is the largest size and up to floor in the size is going to be decreased so sometimes we we'll make that 
mistake of writing the symbols that's why i'm saying that avoid that symbols and you have to write prop in the proper way otherwise you can use both of these methods similarly one more question the elements are given and we have to arrange them in the decreasing order of their atomic size so first of all we should identify from which group or period these elements belong so because it it contain lithium oxygen very limited that means they are members of group uh, period 2 now the correct of period 2 elements is this one and we know that from left to right in a period the atomic size decreases that means the correct order of de uh, decreasing order of atomic size is this we can write in this way or we can use the sign of less than to show that the atomic size decreases from left to right so these are the type of questions which are coming sometime in the exams the ionic radius when an atom lose an electron or gain an electron it become ion. so when an atom become ion the defective distance from the center of the nucleus of the ion up to which it exert influence of the electron cloud that means the outermost shell which contain the electron is called ionic radius let's understand this by an example so see here this is the structure of sodium in which first shell is having two electrons second is having eight and the third is having the one electron but let because sodium always lose electrons and from any post event that is cation so let when sodium lose electron then what happens two things are happening one shell third shell is having no electron so that shell get removed second thing is that in sodium the protons remain 11 because atomic number is 11 but in sodium ion electron become 10 the number of proton become more than number of electrons so because electrons are less, protons are more, so they attract the nuclear electrons towards itself and the atomic size decreases as shown in the structures. So, note that the ionic radius of cation is always smaller than its parent atom. The question arises why? Because the number of electrons become less than proton, so the force of attraction of nucleus increases and hence the radius decreases. But if an atom gain electron, what then what will we have? So let's see that. So here, this is the atomic size of chlorine. So chlorine having 17 electrons and 17 protons, but when it gain electron, what will have? Now the electron become 18, but the proton still remain 7. So the nuclear charge felt by the by the all the electrons decreases because the number of electrons become more than the number of protons. As a result, now the force felt by all the electrons decreases therefore the electron cloud expand or size increases so always remember one thing the radius of an ion is always greater than its parent atom because the number of electron increases whereas the nuclear charge remain the same so the nuclear charge felt by the electron decreases and therefore the atomic size increases isoelectron ions so ions which of different element that means which have different atomic number but which have same number of electrons are called isoelectronic ions for example, see here, all these are nitrogen in a different element, fluorine is a different element, sodium is different element, magnesium, aluminium are different element. They have different charges over them. But in case of nitrogen, the number of electrons become 10, 7 proton plus 3 more electrons because negative 3 signs, so the number of electrons become 10. In case of fluorine, atomic number is 9, but that means proton are 9s. But because it is having minus 1, that means electron, 1 electron is more than proton, that means 10 electrons. In case of sodium ion, the proton are 11 but because it having positive one charge that means one electron is less than proton that therefore sodium also have 10 electrons in case of magnesium atomic number 12 that means protons 12 but two positive charge means two electrons are less than protons so therefore magnesium two positive ions also have 10 electrons similarly in case of aluminium proton 13 but three positive charge means three electrons are less than protons so the number of electrons become 10 so all these ions they have different charges, different elements, but the number of electrons remains same. Therefore, they are called isoelectronic species. Important note, in a particular period, the atomic size of normal gas is highest. So that's why we are not taking halogens while explaining the atomic size by arranging the atom seven various atom and periods. In a period, the atomic size decreases. But when we reach at the end of the period, that is up to normal gas, the size of that normal gas increases. Why? Because noble gas have completely filled outermost shell, so the effect of nuclear pull on the valence electron shells do not see. So that's why when we move along a period, the atomic size first decreases, but in case of noble gas, it further increases. So in a particular period, the atomic size of noble gas is highest. For example, in period 2, neon and in period 3, argon have the largest size. Point 2. Among all the elements in period predictable fluorine has the smallest size and cesium has the larger size learn this also sometimes this type of question is coming in one marks questions or in case of ncqs 
study the topics which we have studied in this video and do the written practice in next video part 4 you will see metallic and non metallic characters factor affecting them and variation of metallic and non metallic character along groups and period please like and subscribe the channel for the latest update thank you